Hi, it's Corey the Treasure Hunter. I just got back from a killer hunt and uh, can't wait to share it with you. I uh, found a little bit of everything and a couple big surprises. Started off a little slow, but then I got hot and uh, all I can say is there was a lot of sex. <laughs> I don't know what else to say, <laughs> but there was a lot. So get ready. Well, we're here at Oakland in the little tot lot at the lake, and then we're gonna go into the woods, but we wanted to hit it real quick. It's raining. So this is gonna be an interesting hunt. First target was this little guy. Not sure if it's silver or not, but it definitely looks cool. A little half moon. Anyways, got him in there. And uh, usually when I find something good the first target, I don't have the best hunt, but you got to keep pushing through it. And that's what I'm going to do. So. Welcome to the channel and we'll see what we get. Going to hunt around here real quick before all the little toddlers come in and then uh, go into the woods, like I said. I think we got our first ring here. I thought I was just kicking something. But... Uh, oh yeah. I don't think it's anything special. I mean, other than it being a ring. But uh, it's the elements are getting crazy here. So a little copper guy was probably silver plated once. It's like a little V for victory. Hopefully, we get some victories today. Been already uh, filling up this guy. Got a couple finds in there already. Ah, this one gets its own little space here. Fits right in there. Boom. And there's some other nice target right around here too. So we'll be in the top lot for a couple more minutes and then we're heading on to the woods. At first I thought it was a cannonball, but this thing is just too round. And what would a cannonball be doing <laughs> over here? I have no idea. So it's gotta be a bocce ball or something, but it's solid. Uh, I don't even have pockets big enough for this thing. It's definitely not going in my treasure finds case. So, but this is a cool find. Can't wait to see what it looks like if I could, if I'm able to clean it up. But we're just going down the lake, walking the little spots and hunting. So we're we're trying to go over there, but we we came across this little spot. This is my first target. So, anyways, rainy day, rainy day hunting. So let's keep going. Been slim pickings on really good targets, but lots of change. Just got a dollar coin. John Quincy Adams. Oh yeah, little ball guy. I now bring you to our wildlife portion of the show. We have an appearance from the Canadian Royal Air Force here. They don't seem too on me this morning. All right, out of ease, out of ease. Stand down, stand down. Say hi, little guy. Hey, come here. You think I got food? <laughs> Look at him. I have nothing. He's all over my coil. These guys will take advantage of you. You're not paying attention. <laughs> think I got something? Look at these guys. Come here, fat kid. I wish I had food for you, but I don't. <laughs> Scram! <laughs> no molest day. <laughs> You're gonna steal my stuff? I think I just popped my second dollar coin. Got a lot of these. Mar Martin Van Buren. I love the Statue of Liberty on the back. So it's cheap for the day. Oh yeah. After uh, getting molested by some squirrels, still just uh, chugging along here. Haven't really found too much, but uh, gonna keep trying. All right, stay tuned. I think I finally found something that's uh, unique. Thought it was just a quarter, but it's got a scorpion here. So this could be, oh, it is. It's connect with a, connect with the astro, uh, astrology token. So this is like a little, uh, 
porn store sex token thing. Let's see if we can get a good one. This one's in really good shape compared to the last one I found. Might be a little graphic, so just letting you know. Second one I found in this area. Oh yeah. So I forgot what the scorpion is. Cancer, probably. No, cancer's the crabs. Scorpio. Duh. <laughs> Scorpio. It's got the scorpion there. And then it's got a, a lovemaking position there. Uh, I can't really make it out. Uh, I don't know if I should, but uh, very awesome find. The, I was looking for one of these. Now I only need uh, 12, or sorry, there's 12 total. And I have two. And uh, yeah, I want to find the other 10. So, yeah. yeah. I think I just dug up another one. There's like a bunch around here. I wonder if this is the same one though. Uh, another Scorpio. Oh, this one's in pretty good condition too. That is a, uh, well, <laughs> just think of the, of the cancer. <laughs> awesome. another one in here too or nothing <laughs> it's nothing just a penny this looks interesting found a quarter but it looks like a rings around it like an actual ring I'm not exactly sure it was uh over by the street. Why am I walking around? I got this in my hand. Never found anything like that. Ooh. Yeah, I'm not sure. It, this this thing's got some design on it, so it could be a ring. A real ring. But it looks really thin, so I'm not sure. Who knows? There's a very interesting situation going on here. Can't really tell when the quarter is, and that's silver though. I'm gonna need more tools. Well, <laughs> it's going in the pocket for now, but I thought that was interesting. I wanted to share it with you guys. That's a little yeah, yeah, yeah. Here's a fancy relic type thing. Not sure what it is, just some kind of cool design. Went on something. Might be too big for my pocket, but I'm gonna try to take it home. Yeah, yeah. Looks like we got our first foreign coin. It's going to be 10 euros, but from where? Looks like it's from Greece. I'm not exactly sure. It's cool in there, 2002. Looks like we got our first uh, game token here. No cash value. Crystal Palace. Looks like a roller rink. That's pretty cool. It's been a couple digs since I found one of these. Not sure what this one's gonna be. I love pressed pennies. I don't know if it's a double-sided one or not. Come on, Disneyland. I wanna go to Disneyland. Cannot tell what that says. This one's interesting. It, it, you can still see the penny, the old penny. That's what I see right there. And then what do we have here? Either way, I'm excited. I love these things. It's gonna be a hard one to see. So I'm gonna have to clean that one up for sure, but she's in the books, baby.
These finds cases coming in handy today. Got all my small finds. Got all my tokens and coins and got my ring in there and some earrings. Oh, this guy won't fit in there. Put him in here. Oh yeah, hey, join your friend. There you go. Oh yeah. Just found this. It's a little shield or something. Let's see what it says. I'm not. I'm not sorry about your fragile masculinity. <laughs> I don't know if it's fragile, but it, <laughs> it might be now. <laughs> wow, uh, interesting. I hope it's silver. <laughs> I think I found a couple keys already, but this one's gonna be cool. It's got an actual keychain on there. And that might be a coin on there. I might have gotten, I might have scored. I'm pretty sure that's a coin. Looks like it's gonna be an Asian type coin, newer. Probably a yen or something. <laughs> that's cool. It's keys and a coin. Just uh, slaying the change. Uh, not sure where Carl went, but I'm gonna go look for him, see what he's found, see if we find anything good. But uh, just mostly getting little knickknacks here and there, so still happy. It's a cold day, so it's a perfect day for hunting. I haven't sweated or gotten anything uncomfortable at all, and it's a perfect temperature, so it's great for me. Stay tuned. It's a little bit of a ground find. Looks like we got some uh, weights here quarter and some lures or a lure and another weight pretty cool oh yeah looks like we got an old coin finally got a weedy not sure what the year is though Could be a 1931. 1955. Looks like we got a big coin in here. It's gonna be a religious coin or something. Oh yeah, found one of these before, but it was uh, aluminum. This one feels like it's copper. This might be the five year. One year of recovery. Cool, I love finding these. Just cruising around this uh, recently burnt down home, homeless encampment. Came across one pound. I don't think I've ever found a pound. Thing's heavy. I wish it was silver, but uh, that's a cool find. God save the queen. Yeah, it's just a normal day in the homeless encampment. Uh, you just wait for them to burn down, which usually takes a couple months if they're on your guys, and then uh, you uh, go in after. That's what I'm doing. So, just gotta watch out for the needles and whatever else left behind. And people are literally hidden underneath this stuff, so you gotta be careful. You might be metal detecting on someone's face. Definitely just found some kind of religious item. I think it's just copper, but it's a cross with some hands on it. Super heavy. Yeah, it's brass. That was a cool one. Found a uh, bicentennial quarter. Guess whose favorite quarter that is? Always thinking about you guys. Yeah, yeah. Just checking out this guy's old residence, and boom! 
That that looks pretty good. Ah, oh, it's blingage. But it's a cool little ring. Yeah, that's that's just a cool ring. Yeah you. I think I just popped up something silver. Oh, look at this. Oh yeah, finally. That's most likely silver, that's a nice charm. I got this on camera. That'll clean up really nice. It's got all kinds of cool stuff on there. Uh, I'd be surprised if that wasn't silver, but I'm gonna keep looking for more stuff. I'm gonna be heading home soon, so. This is a sweet find. That won't fit in the, in the finds case, that's for sure. But can't wait to get a close-up of that. Yeah, yeah. is coming out and I got another press penny for the day the last one I found turned out to be a fairyland one which is right where I'm hunting by but this one says Las Vegas hockey that's like a brand new one they just got a hockey team cool two press pennies gonna be calling it a day soon had a great day and uh, can't wait to do the next one but we'll do a, a cleanup and a take and all that stuff and see what I really got Thank you for being here. Thank you for watching. Thank you for supporting. Can't wait to uh, go on a hunt again. Oh, look at that tree over there. I gotta go over there. All right, hey, so uh, back to the hunt. I don't know what to say. It's been like a sexy day. I got a heads or tail token. This one, you can see the, the goods on this one. But uh, yeah, something about Oakland. Freak show. Yeah. just working right in here on this uh, right next to the curb and just plucked a dime and then this thing which I'm pretty sure is going to be silver it looks really cool and old it's an old earring hell yeah just got another sex token I don't know which one this one is This one's a, the astrological ones, I think. Looks like a bowl or something, so it's probably a Taurus. Oh, that's a crazy position there. I don't know if to clean it up, but yeah, another one. Now I only need a nine. Yeah. I just found another one. I actually found my my sign, which is an Aries. I can tell right there there's a ram on there. And the uh, March 21st through April 20th, so this one's in good shape. Uh, wow. <laughs> I think I found another one. I might as well just live dig it. <laughs> so probably be a penny now.
Well, I hope you enjoyed this hunt. I know I did. Just a couple friendly reminders. I got the pull tab, pull tab drive going. Uh, just need a couple more stickers and some, maybe some cars, and then I'll start putting together all the lots, and we'll do the lottery. Hopefully, to hopefully I'll be able to do it live. I've never done that before, so it'll be fun, uh, challenging experience, and uh, <laughs> who knows what'll happen. Oh, and don't forget, I got a giveaway coming up very next episode, I hope. Uh, that's going to be my clad. How much clad I got? So, if you want a chance to take my loot and be part of the Eternal Winner's Circle, you got to see the next episode. Give it your best shot. Go from there. See what you got.